guys. So I just want to show you how to do a shadow on an image. So I'm going to bring an SVG in. So you do that by hitting this little SVG, import SVG. I've got it on my desktop. And I'm going to show you with this rose. So when you have an image selected, I'm actually just going to make it a little smaller. You'll see this appearance option over here. And to make a shadow, you'll just click that drop down and you have all these options. So you can do rounded, pointy, straight, but the major difference is shadow or blackout. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this so you can see the original image and you can see the shadow and I just copy pasted that. So you've got the original on the left and I'm just going to do shadow rounded. Now what you see is because this rose has multiple pieces, you'll see that there are, you know, little pieces of the shadow. And you would do that if you just want to, you know, give different definition, but usually when you do a shadow with layers, you want to do blackout. So then that just gives you a whole big shadow so when you cut this part out and then it lays on top of here, you don't have all the little white spaces that you have if you just do shadow. So when you go to cut, then you would have an image that looks like this. Let me just change the color of the rose to show you. And it's a little dark, so let's just bring it to the front. So that's what that would look like. And then if you want to change it to blackout, it would look like that. Now if you want to do an outline, so say you don't want to layer it, you just want the outline of an image, you would select them both. And you would do the path and now I know that the red rose part is on the front so I'm gonna do back minus the front because I don't want the front I just want the outline so then you would get that